John fights in, in Las Vegas and Dana White shows up. It's with Shooto USA against Shoney Carter. Mm -hmm. I looked for this fight everywhere and I couldn't find it. Would you mind walking us through it? Man, I just, I was, they beat him up pretty good. I, I remember thinking like this, this can't be, this is way easier than it should be. Cause it was my, it was my first UFC vet. And, you know, a lot of people were like, he's going to get killed by showing a spinning back fist, whatever. But I just <clears throat> punched my way into position, slammed him on the ground, beat him up on the ground, back and forth. Uh, he tried to spin back kick, spinning back fist at the end of one round. I saw the tell when he, when he starts to turn, I threw a yeah. head kick and I, I caught him. I went a little too soon and I ended up hitting part of the armpit, but I kind of kicked him in the face. Um, and then, yeah, when I started the next round, I like hit a single leg, took him down, put my shoulder to his belly and he tapped out from the single leg, rolled over it and threw up on the, on the mat. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. You and, put your, you get him right Dana was pissed. I guess Dana went there that night because he was supposed to like, it was supposed to be the comeback and re-signing of Shoney Carter, but oh, um, okay. I smashed him and Dana was mad. So John, your, your cardio is phenomenal. Like I've, I've watched probably about, about 80% of your fights and your, your conditioning and cardio is amazing. So when I saw the Shoney Carter bout on, on your record, Shoney wins most of his fights by just being in better shape than a person across from him. Like if there's Shoney was, he was a good guy. fighter. He kind of keep the same Durable. pace throughout the fight. Yeah. Yeah. Just experience is how he yeah. wins. Durable, Where guys out out, it's free. hard to keep in certain positions. Like he's going to move. Yeah. He doesn't pressure you heavy, but like, yeah, he can, he can be there. 